Rashid Jogi is unsung hero of the Zimbabwean contemporary art history and um, this exhibition is kind of really uh, a retrospective of his work and the need to realize the work he has contributed to the art. Uh, life drawings is a discipline in art, okay, which enhances hand and eye coordination. It's the vocabulary of the artist, okay. In my painting, made, uh, making as an abstract painter, it's necessary that I uh, incorporate the elements of drawing in my work. So that actual process enhances the vocabulary of the painter. As a musician would study scales, an artist has to study to do to study the life figure. Drawing is a discipline. It's the most difficult thing to draw, the sensitivity of the human body. Uh, through my research, coming back and forwards in Uruguay and working, trying to see what I can do for the National Gallery in terms of the differences, I realized that I came across uh, going through Rashid's studio and his house. I realized I came out with these amazing drawings which has been doing from 1978 to 2001 and I thought since I want to give him a solo show this was a new beginning for me to be able to surprise the Zimbabwean audience because Rashid is known through his abstract painting. Rashid is a friend and he's a catalyst in the visual arts. He's spontaneous. He, he, he works from the inner man. I found that the life drawing sessions themselves were very therapeutic, okay, the process of sitting in a classroom or sitting in a studio with many other people drawing, the collective experience of uh, concentration, all you could hear in those classes were the squeaks of the pen on paper or the scratchings of pencil or charcoal on paper.